Hi everyone, it's B with BG Jams and tonight I am going to walk you through an application of Jamberry's True Shine Gel Enamel Kit. I just got my kit today um, and I'm excited to use it for the first time. I've heard some great things about it. Pardon me, I'm actually in my pajamas but it's late and I've got some things that I need to get done but I wanted to get this because I showed... Um, I got the package today and I was really excited. So, um, the first important thing that you will need to do, obviously, is clean and prep your nails. And I've already done that. And I'm actually, um, I have applied, um, a wrap as my accent nail to two nails on each hand. And here is the wrap. I'm using, um, I'm using Fractal, which is our new one of, from the new fall catalog. I have cleaned and prepped my nails really well, but I am going to give them one more swipe before I get started. So what you're going to need, and it comes in your kit, is um, you're going to need your orange wood stick, which your kit comes with. You're going to need your rubber cuticle pusher, which your kit also comes with. I actually prepped by using my cuticle remover. I love this stuff. I have really bad invisible cuticles, so I use this stuff all the time. You're going to need an alcohol wipe. Um, you're going to need a nail file to shape your nails prior to your um, application. And like I said, once you shape your nails, you're going to want to clean them really well. Um, I have washed my hands really well with the blue dishwashing detergent to remove all the oils. Um, and you're going to need your Jamberry True Shine LED lamp. Um, now what I've read all the instructions and keep in mind this is my first application as well um, so you're also going to need your gel enamel base coat and this is you're going to apply this first you're going to need your gel enamel color and I'm using toasted and you're going to need your gel enamel top coat. Now when just applying to your wraps or if you are applying it over regular Jamberry lacquer, you're going to put your um, lacquer and your wrap on first before you put the base coat or the top coat on. And this is because um, you're going to cure the gel and not the actual wrap so it's going to have a gel coating over it same with the lacquer the system won't work if you do the base coat the lacquer then the top coat you have to do um the lacquer then the base coat and the top coat and you'll notice that these are in black bottles even the color is in a black bottle and that is because you don't want to expose it to a lot of light um the other tip that i've gotten is that prior to using because the stuff is really thick you want to um shake your bottles up so we're going to be doing that um so like i said i've prepped my nails really well i used my cuticle remover and i washed them really good i took off all the excess cuticles so right now i'm going to use my jamberry nail prep and i am going to clean just do a quick swipe of my nails with my nail and let's get this stuff over here out of the way so i'm going to swipe my nails to get off all the cookies that um, I cleaned them really well right before I started doing the video but we'll do it again um, just in case I accidentally touched any of my nails which is quite a possibility so um, my nails are nice and clean and they're ready to go I have different accent nails on each hand because I like to be different and I love fractal and just to give a shout out to my VIPs they picked this Manny for me I have a um, vendor event this weekend and I asked what they thought I should do and they all voted for fractal and toasted so that's what we're going to do. So the first thing that you need to do is um, always be careful when you're applying that you don't get any on your skin uh, because it's the same as the wraps it will cause it not to stick. So the first thing that you do is this is the base coat I'm going to give it a good shake. And according to the video produced by Jamberry and according to the instructions that I got in the kit, you do your four fingers and then these four fingers, you do your four fingers and cure and these four fingers and cure and then you do your thumbs together. Um, 
and that's just the way it's designed to fit in the lamp and then you do your thumbs together um, I'm probably just gonna walk you through the one hand and then um, I will post a picture of the finished product but um, the first thing you do is you're going to apply a thin layer oh this stuff is thick guys a thin layer of the base coat to your nails so let me do that I don't know can you see just a thin ooh, it's really thick guys thin layer up the top and then you need to seal it so you're going to go across like that and swipe so thin layer like this and then across the top and swipe. Thin layer. Across the top and swipe. It's really shiny. And then a thin layer. And you'll notice these two I'm putting on over the wrap. So, and then we're going to seal. I'm going to get that seal in there. Okay, and then you have to cure it. So let's go ahead and cure it. Let's put the top on real good. Turn my lamp on and it automatically stays on for 45 seconds. Oh. I don't know if you can see. It's kind of tingly. There you go. It's a really bad picture. There you go. And then it's supposed to shut off. Sorry for the automatic uh, light there. Uh, it's supposed to shut off on its own. So we will see. It's curing. Pardon me while I read the instructions, but that's always a good thing to do. You always need to use the instructions. Care with the LED lamp for 45 seconds. And it went off. See, so there we go. And now it says apply a thin layer of your color coat starting at the base of the cuticle blush over the free edge of the nail to create a seal. Use orange stick to remove any excess from around the nail, so that's why you have to have that. And then cure with the LED curing lamp for 45 seconds and you reapply the coats to get the color that you want so let's take a look i'm going to give the toasted a good shake and let's do this so we're only actually going to do two fingers on this hand right now oh it's really pretty guys can you see that oh no this way really pretty so thin coat i'm like terrified to screw this up so, oh, yeah, thin coat. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's like a champagne color. And then swipe over the top. Same as you did with the base coat. So thin coat. And then swipe. And then it's time to cure for another 45 seconds. So I'm going to turn on my lamp. And I will restart this when it's done. Okay, so I have actually done three coats of the toasted on this one hand. So here is what it looks like. It's really shimmery. Um, so now we are on the last step. Actually, I got it on my skin. It is on there good, guys. Alright. So now we're doing the last step. So the last step is to put on your top coat and it's the same process so you're going to do a thin coat from the ooh that's really thick I'm gonna shake this up a bit um, a thin coat from the cuticle to the tip of your nail and then you're going to do a swipe across this way to get a seal on that gel so thin coat and swipe thin coat Um, and here's a little tip. When I put my wraps on, I always file mine at a 45 degree angle as opposed to the 90 degree angle. I always leave a little sliver 
of nail showing just at the top and really only I can see it and that really seems to keep my nails my wraps from lifting and fraying when I do that um, and I think it's probably also going to help get that seal on the gel that I'm looking for so we shall see you're getting close I'll pause it when it's done. Okay, so that is done. I've done my top coat. I've done my... Ooh. So funny. Okay, I've done my top coat. So it's all done. You can touch it. It's cured. It does feel a little tacky. And that is because the last step is to take your nail prep wipe. And get it open and just do a swipe to clean off that extra cookie stuff. But otherwise, you're good to go. So there we go, guys. I will post a picture when I'm done. I'm gonna do my thumb and my other hand. So I will see you later. If you want more information about True Shine, go to my website, www.jamberrybg.jamberry.com and click on the shop now icon and then click on true shine or you can check out my blog my blog not blog at b g b e a g jams dot wordpress dot com i'll talk to you later bye